Now, the first stage of a major Aberdeen project to bring steam trains back to the Granite City got underway today. A steel railway turntable, which is part of the Ferry Hill Locomotive Depot, has been removed from the site for restoration. Marelle Wilson has the story. It's full steam ahead on the regeneration of a disused railway line in Aberdeen. Today, a 21-tonne turntable was lifted from the Ferry Hill site beside Duffy Park. It's the first stage of a major project to reinstate a working steam train line in the city. The turntable will now be taken away to Contour for restoration before the next stage of the project, which will involve the replacement of the existing railway tracks. The turntable itself uh, we're looking to complete within about a year. The next stage is to put all the railway track back onto the turntable because obviously the rails have been removed and the sleepers have to be replaced. The site itself contains uh, the original 1850s engine shed and it will form the uh, core of the museum uh, which we're, operate, we're going to operate on this site. Built in 1906, the turntable was in operation until the year 2000. It's now one of only three of the A-listed structures in Scotland. The people behind it say the regeneration could have a huge impact on the local area. People can come in and we'll actually have a small engine later on. There's one sitting down there, a steam engine. We can turn it and show people what used to happen, you know, almost on a daily basis. So it will be a good adjunct to Duthie Park, which has about a million visitors a year. While there's still a further £100,000 to be raised before the project can be completed, the restoration of the turntable is a major milestone in bringing steam trains back to Aberdeen. Morel Wilson, STV News.